Hello Class of 2017. The position of Class Secretary is vital to our class's success, organization, and happiness. I believe that I am the best choice to fulfill this position's duties and expectations. My academic dedication and my ability to lead as well as cooperate with others makes me the optimal choice for Secretary. If elected as your sophomore Class Secretary, I will do everything in my power to make next year our most organized and enjoyable year at Durfee. So don't forget to vote Aubrey Carrero as your sophomore Class Secretary on Election Day. Hi class of 2017, I'm Melina Nchowski and I'm running for class treasurer. I would be a great pick for treasurer because my goal is to make next year more interesting and have more activities. I decided to run because I felt that this year things could have been better for the freshmen. The sad truth is that this year we didn't accomplish almost anything. If you elected me, I would try my best to have everyone's voice be heard and acknowledged. Make sure you vote me, Alina, for class treasurer if you want to see a positive change next year. I will not disappoint. Hi, my name is Kevin Tanelko, and I'm running for sophomore class vice president. I would appreciate it if you voted for me on June 11th because I believe I'd make a solid candidate for vice president. Thank you. Good afternoon, students of Durfee High. I am Atisha Flores, and I will be running for 2017 class treasurer. Although this is my first year in Durfee, I've had so many great experiences, from meeting new people, joining the softball team, and taking the chance to run for this. As a candidate, I can't promise you a lot of things, but I can promise you a good leader, one who is willing to hear others' opinions. I'll try my hardest to show others it's okay to be different. It's okay not to be perfect and be yourself. Your treasurer needs to know it's just not about handling money, but also being a role model, giving others respect and expecting the same in return. As your future treasurer, my intentions are the same as yours, to have a fun year, but also stay on top of school demands. And if chosen, I will take the responsibility <laughs> to fulfill that intention. Let's make this year memorable and remember to vote for Leticia Flores. Hi class of 2017, I'm Brittany Tabikas and I'm running for sophomore class vice president. This past year I've been a part of the varsity field hockey team, the interact club, and the varsity softball team. I'm running as vice president because I'd like to get involved and I'd like to change the way things are around here. I believe I could be a good leader for our class and I believe I could contribute ideas for our benefit such as pep rally ideas and certain fun events for our class. As vice president, I'll make sure our class is remembered and the best class Derpy's ever had. I'd appreciate a vote from me, Brittany Tabikas, to be your sophomore class vice president. Hi, I am John Paul McDonald and I'm running for sophomore class treasurer. I feel that I'm the best fit for this position because I am well organized, dedicated, and committed to planning and supporting events and fundraisers that will help our class have a successful and enjoyable year. I hope you consider me, John Paul McDonald, when you make your decision to elect a sophomore class treasurer. Thank you. Hello, my name is Mark Corey and I am running for the sophomore class secretary. I plan to make the upcoming year entertaining and successful. Vote for me, Mark Curry, on June 11th as your sophomore class secretary. Thank you. Hi, I'm Mira Saba, and I'm running for sophomore class treasurer. I'm currently part of the Freedom Writers Club, Sixth Man Club, Fred TV Club, and tennis team here at Durfee. As a student in the class of 2017 and Durfee High School, I understand that it is super important to become involved within our school as much as possible to make the most out of our student careers. If elected as sophomore treasurer, I'd like to bring up some ideas for events and other proposals, some of which including student-teacher competitions for fundraising, a class talent show, and a class field trip at the end of the year. I know our class is incredibly unique and full of potential, which is why I'd love to become an officer in charge of getting things done and making our sophomore year as successful as it could ever be. As treasurer, I'd like to put our money where our mouths are and make things happen on the greatest scale achievable. I am positive that within each of us is substantial energy that will make next year full of full of positivity no matter what, and I would be honored if I were elected as a cl class officer to help propel that energy into greatness. Thank you, and remember to vote Mira Saba for sophomore treasurer on June 11th. Hi, my name is Mikaela De Silva, and I am running for sophomore class president. I have been an active participant in the Durfee community. As of right now, I play varsity field hockey. As president, I would like for the students to have a voice as to what occurs within our class. With every event or activity that the sophomore class presents, my goal would be for you, the students, to have the ability to say and present an opinion about the subject. Student government isn't just something that four people lead. It's something that we as an entire class lead and contribute to. This is why I care about what my class has to say about Derby. Running a successful government isn't just about having strong leaders. It's about having people who stand with you for things you believe in. Thank you, and remember to vote Michaela De Silva for sophomore class president. Hello, I'm Sierra Bernardo and I'm running to be our sophomore class secretary. As your class secretary, I hope to gather valuable opinions from students who wish to contribute to upcoming events. This particular job is to record important information and meetings of student government as a whole, but to also collect opinions about fundraisers, activities, and plenty more. If elected, I will put my leadership skills to the test and hopefully guide the class of 2017 to an abundant year of enjoyment with the help of our fellow officers who are to be elected. 
On June 11th, during lunch, I advise you to vote for the candidate who will efficiently and effectively work as your sophomore class secretary. When casting your vote, remember that a prosperous leader contains Durfee pride. Purpose, responsibility, innovation, diligence, and empowerment. Hello class of 2017. My name is Reggie McDonald and I'm running for sophomore vice president. This year I'm determined to work to my very best potential and make this sophomore year memorable. I want all of you to know that I will take this job very seriously. All decisions I make and decisions I assist will be made to benefit all of you. As a current member of student government, I hope and ask for your vote. Thank you. Hello, friends and family, except I don't have family in the school, so I guess that was a dumb opening. But I'm going to be running for sophomore president, and as sophomore president, I'm going to do what I can. Now, I know there's not really much you can do. I got the list. There's really only like four things, but I'll do what I can. And don't listen to any of those liars saying that they're going to change the school. You spent two years here. You know it's not going to change much. But, you know... It'll make me happy. So vote for me. I'm honest and it'll make me happy. Hi, my name is Charlie Martin. I'm running for sophomore class president. I believe I am a good candidate for president because of my ability to lead. So on June 11th, please vote for me. Thank you. Hello, everyone. My name is Alyssa Jusam, and I am running to be our 2016 class treasurer. As class treasurer, I will be designated to deal with all of our financial records, help with fundraisers, and make sure that all of our financial information is kept up to date. I understand my position and will achieve it to the best of my abilities, but I also want to do more. As a member of the student government, one of my main goals is to make sure that I am a voice for the student body. I will make sure that everyone has a voice and that your opinions and your ideas will be heard during the meetings. This is our school, and after all, all of the money in our class account that I will be dealing with will have been earned by all of us. The money that we raise will go towards fun events that we will be doing during our junior year. You only get to have one junior year, and I will help make sure that it will be a great one. With junior prom and every other exciting event that comes with this year, I will be the one to help deal with all the financial business and make sure that all your concerns and wants are addressed. Not only will we be saving money for junior year, but our senior year as well. Using the resources that I have, I will make sure that our money is being used to fulfill our class's wants and needs. This year, our sophomore class tied with the seniors for the best door decorations and skit. I will make sure that we remain being number one in our junior year and that our props and ideas work well together to continue with our success. The class on fire will continue, but in a different, exciting new way that is sure to be successful. As far as fundraising goes, I have many fundraising ideas that I would like to see happen that would enhance our budget. With more money to reasonably spend, the possibilities are endless as far as what exciting things we could do in order to enhance our high school experience during our junior year. I cannot do this alone. I need the help of each and every one of you, and your ideas will be strongly appreciated, accepted, and taken into consideration. So, on election day, when you are voting for your class representatives, keep in mind who will fulfill their class obligations the best. Junior year is like the Thursday night of high school, the beginning of the end. So help me help you make our junior year a great one. Hi, my name is Lena Pavid and I'm running for re-election as your class secretary in the upcoming year. I spent my first two years at Durfee as a swimmer and a member of several clubs. Over the past year, I served as secretary for both the Durfee Interact Club and our sophomore class. These positions have prepared me for taking on the larger tasks we will face as we go on to a very important junior year. As secretary, my job is to assist my fellow officers with organization and communication, as well as working to improve student involvement in our class. I spent a lot of time as a class officer coordinating events and fundraisers. I was very involved in planning pep rally this year, which has been the highlight of my time as an officer. I believe that I was an active and efficient secretary in my first year in office. As sophomores, we had an incredible year and were largely successful in everything, from pep rally to fundraising. I have many great ideas that I can't wait to share with our class. I hope to improve even more in our junior year as we prepare for bigger and better things, like prom and defending our pep rally title. Being a representative for our class has been a great experience that I hope to repeat next year. So please, vote Alina Pavid as your junior class secretary on June 11th. Thank you. Hi, my name is Katrina Freyer and I am running for your junior class treasurer. For the last two years, I have been a member of Derby Student Government. Over these years, as a class, we have achieved many things, like great pep rally, school events, and fundraising. This year has been great, and I want to make sure that next year will be even better. We are already planning events to make sure that our junior year is amazing, like an awesome pep rally and a great prom along with other events, but we need your vote to make this happen. So on June 11th, vote Katrina Ferreira for your junior class treasurer. 
Hi, I'm Leah Granham, and I believe that I am the best candidate to become your junior class secretary. I am dedicated, organized, and responsible. I'm willing to do what it takes to better student government as a whole. Yes, I'll make mistakes, but in the end, I will follow through in everything I do. I will go the extra mile to get any tasks done and help others in the process. I don't believe in just doing what I'm asked for. However, I try to go further and accomplish more. I'll give all my time and put in 100%. If I have the privilege of being elected, I will give it my all and give my best effort. If elected, I will work well with everyone, maintain information and record keeping, and make sure student government is organized. I will work hard to improving student government and push through any hardship that may come my way. Student government isn't perfect, but I believe that it can become a better environment if I were elected as secretary. In everything I do, I will make sure I work to the best of my ability. My best is always good enough once I have the right motivation and drive to do so. Through student government, I feel that it will be, give me the drive to become great and the motivation to accomplish everything. Elect me as your class secretary and I will make sure to succeed in everything. To succeed is my main goal and I won't finish anything until I know that what I did was the best I can do. Choose me to be your class secretary and I promise I will not disappoint you. Thank you. Hello class of 2016, my name is Madison Coogan for those of you who do not know me and I am running to be the class of 2016's vice president for our junior year. I would like to start off by saying that although I've never been an elected officer during my time here at Durfee, I have always tried my best to be involved. Whether it was helping out with pep rally, coming to every class meeting that I could attend, or volunteering at various events, I always put in the time and effort to be involved and help get things done for our class and I will continue to do so if elected as your vice president. I have experience organizing and planning events with other students such as field trips and dances as I was a VP in middle school. I played an active role in helping our class organize events and plan for pep rally in both our freshman and sophomore years and I know what it takes to win. I'm on three different sports teams here at Durfee and that has taught me that teamwork and dedication lead to success. I'm also a student who is involved in the arts and multiple academic clubs and by being involved in so many great experiences at Durfee, I have learned that time management is an important thing and that it's important to be involved in the school community. By being involved in several different programs from many different backgrounds, I feel I would be a well-rounded candidate for the job. As we approach our junior year, I have many great suggestions for our class, such as prom planning ideas and fun activities. And if elected, I work with the other elected officers to fundraise and plan events so that we can have a great junior year. I will not make empty promises, but the two promises I will make are that if elected your vice president, I will always put in my best effort to make our junior year fun, but most importantly, a success and a memorable one. I promise that I will listen to your ideas and implement them to help our class in every way possible. So I ask that when you vote, you vote for the candidate who you feel is best for the job. So remember, vote Madison Coogan for the class of 2016's vice president. Thank you. My name is Brendan McDonald and I'm running for vice president of the junior class. I decided to run this year after much thought. I didn't want to be a voice on the sidelines. I wanted to make a difference. I also want you to help me make a difference. Getting the class involved with decisions is a main goal of mine. I ask you, the class of 2016, to give me your vote, and I promise to work to my greatest potential. You will be proud to be a Hilltopper. Thank you. Hi, my name is Osmar Garcia, and I'm running for junior class vice president. I believe I will be a good candidate to represent Durfee because Durfee is full of diversity, and that is something we should be proud of. I want to make sure that everyone's opinions are being voiced and that no one is left unheard. To accomplish this, I promise that I will listen to anyone who wants to be involved in our school community and make sure that they have the support needed to validate their ideas because cooperation and participation are the only ways we will make a positive change and change is what we need in this school. Since only a select few students tend to be involved with school activities, whereas I would like all students to be involved in these events and activities, I will attempt to raise participation at school events. To make this happen, I will support and create events that interest all students. It would be wonderful to see all students come together and participate. And creating events like these are what I feel is the true purpose of student government. My goal is to represent all of Durfee as a whole and all the students in it. If you elect me as your class vice president, I will not fail an attempt to involve all of our students. And I will try my absolute best to make our junior year a memorable one. Si ustedes sienten que nadie les pone atención, yo estoy aquí para hacer la voz de ustedes. Sepan que yo les voy a poner atención a todas sus necesidades. So when you are voting on election day, Remember to vote for the person who will best represent Durfee. Vote Liz Mar Garcia for junior class vice president. Hello, my name is Kayu Hara and I am running to be the class president for our junior year. I have many ideas that I want to see happen next year, and regardless of whether or not I'm elected, I can assure you that I plan on working on these projects. Also, 
I can promise that I will not start any project if I cannot also guarantee that I will see it through to its end, whatever that end may be. But I must clarify, just because I devote myself to something does not guarantee its success. But I will ensure that it has a fair chance and will receive genuine consideration. Now, to be honest, I am not a very creative person, but I don't feel like that is necessarily a bad thing. I do understand that nothing will change without new ideas being created. And I'm sure that if elected, many of the things that I work on will not have in fact been thought of by myself. But coming up with all of the ideas is not my goal. <clears throat> I do not want our class's actions to be thought of and constructed solely by myself. Because then I wouldn't be a class representative. I'd be an ignorant spokesperson. I'm not running for the position of my best friend's representative, nor my own, but yours and our classes. If elected, I will ensure that your ideas are represented properly, that they are never left neglected. My main goal is to reconnect our student body with our student government. I want you all to be involved in our school, to care what's going on, to occasionally analyze the calendars that are scattered throughout the school, and eagerly look forward to the next school event. I want our enthusiasm and our pride to exist even when it's not the week leading up to pep rally, but I know that can be hard. I know it's difficult to be appreciative of school when you feel like it has done little for you, but if elected, I will make sure that you no longer feel this way and that you can start appreciating your school a little bit more. And also, we tied for first place this year in pep rally. We did this because we all worked together and we worked hard, and it paid off. Imagine if we went at the entire year with that kind of work ethic. What I'm offering to you all is, a, is my promise, my promise that I will try my hardest to accomplish the goals that we set, and that I will be at every step of the way on our journeys towards these goals. And yeah, that's basically it. But let me give you my own definition of a phrase that we've all heard a plenty of times before. I feel that Derfy pride is when you care about the school more than a normal person would. It's when you're actually happy that you go to Derfy instead of somewhere else. It's when you want to better the school environment because it's almost a second home. It's when you realize that you're a part of this community and you welcome that fact with open arms. When you are voting on June 11th, don't just vote for someone because they're your friend. Vote for a candidate because you know they have true Derfy pride and that they will help others achieve Derfy pride. Hi, I'm Julia Karam and I am running for re-election as your junior class president. We've come a long way since freshman year. There were successes that were easy to see, like the seniors' faces when we tied for first place during pep rally, but there were also things behind the scenes that not all of you got to see, like how we raised nearly $1,000 through class fundraisers, and hopefully more will come with events already set to take place this summer. Sophomore year was great, but it's time to look forward to junior year and all of the events that come with it. I am confident that I and the other elected officers will be fully capable of meeting and surpassing everyone's high expectations for pep rally, and also planning a prom that our entire class can enjoy. I hope to lead our class to another successful year, so don't forget to vote for Julia Karam as junior class president on June 11th. Thank you. Only one year left, but there's still so much more to look forward to and accomplish. With me as your vice president, we can achieve this goal together. I'm Brianna Kamara, and I'd like to be the vice president of the class of 2015. These last three years have been both successful and unforgettable. As we look forward to our senior year marked with many milestones such as prom, graduation, and thoughts of college, there's still much work to be done. It's been an honor to serve our class for the past three years, and I hope I can continue to serve you the next year and keep the class of 2015 moving in the right direction. I'm a dedicated student, athlete, friend, and a dedicated Hilltopper, dedicated to fulfill the role of vice president. So please vote for Brianna Kamara, Vice President of the Class of 2015. Hello, Class of 2015. My name is Caroline Batista, and I am running for the Senior Class Secretary. As, approaching, as we are approaching our senior year, we look forward to prom, graduation, and college applications. It is said to be a fun but also stressful year, but with my help, I can make this year more enjoyable. With experiences from last year, I can help make this year our best one yet. Being a captain of the swim team has shown me the responsibilities, dedication, and leadership needed for the job. So vote for me as your Senior Class Secretary. Hey seniors, for those who don't know me, I'm Corny Cabral and I'll be running for class president once again. Every year during elections, we are forced to make these speeches and try to convince you to vote through a teleprompter. I find this silly because it's difficult to deliver a message to a screen rather than your eyes. So this year, I decided to keep it simple. I want you to hear the realness through my voice rather than a planned out phony claim. This year as president, I learned that our class has so many strengths and sometimes we let our weaknesses overpower them. Instead of being united, we branch off into cliques and decide not to work together. But I have so much faith in this class. I learned that being class president doesn't come with ease. It's stressful. But guess what? I strive off that stress because I know my efforts are worth it when I see that everyone is happy and enjoying themselves. Over the course of this year, I participated with the construction of our class door, 
organized junior prom, assisted with field day activities, and raised over two grand for our class throughout various fundraisers. Additionally, I discussed a possible senior trip with our VP and designed class shirts for this upcoming year. Whether I'm re-elected or not, I know I have left this class with resources, materials, and the knowledge you need to succeed. I also know that I made mistakes and failed some of our class's expectations, but these mistakes will only make me a stronger leader. From here on out, we can only move forward. This class, class of 2015, will leave a mark at this school and won't be forgotten. All we need is a little guidance and unity. I'm running for president not to be the decision maker for this class, but to be a proud leader and a voice. In fact, every junior here at Durfee has a voice. So promise you this, on June 11th, grab a ballot and let your voice be heard. Whether the results fall in my favor or not, we have accomplished the first step in moving forward to a more vocal and united class. Once again, I'm Courtney Cabral and I'd be more than honored to continue being your class president. Hello class of 2015, I am Dylan Alette and I am running for class treasurer. Many of you may know me and I know many of you. I know what counts when it comes to holding the position of treasurer for I have been treasurer of the science club. Durfee's cash will be booming like Wall Street, all thanks to a trans sector of power from the people. I know that responsibility. Plus who doesn't want to toss dollar bills at prom? The currency will be flowing through the hallways and people will know the class of 2015 is the wolf behind it all. I took the opportunity to join, many, to join clubs around the school like fencing thanks to a close friend of mine. It hasn't been easy for me sometimes when it comes to others, but thanks to clubs like fencing and the science club and great leadership from my friends who take active roles in the club, I have become a better person. Now I'm not just counting money behind a desk. I am a man of many ideas and I can contribute suggestions to, a be to better the class as a whole. We need people in office who can make changes, people from another spectrum. I am the man for the job. I am teaming up with Candidate Lewis in supporting the Durfee Hilltop Reconstruction Act, a plan that will help every student. On election day, raise the gold bars high in the air and vote Dylan because I am no villain. Thank you. Hi, my name is Jenny Ruda and I'm running for your senior class treasurer. As your treasurer, I will work hard to be your voice and to put your ideas into action. Together, we can make our senior year the best year yet. I will be engaged in the Spirit Week door decorating, and I'm ready to get the class of 2015 back on top. I will participate, work hard, and strive to be the best treasurer for the class of 2015. So remember, when you're voting for senior class treasurer, vote Jenny Arruda. Hello, class of 2015. My name is Caitlin Remy, and I'm here today to ask for your vote for senior class president. Although I have never run for a student government position before, I have involved myself with student government by assisting other candidates as they are prepared for their race. I believe that I am the right person for our senior class president because I care about our school and I want people to voice their opinion. So please vote for me, Caitlin Remy, as your senior class president. Thank you. Guten Tag, class of 2015. I'm Louis Cabral. I'm running for the position of senior class president. This year, Durfee has made me more involved than ever, becoming president of the fencing club, science club, and scoring number 10 on the top 10 speakers in the south coast of Massachusetts for debate. There are numerous other clubs and events that I have done, but I don't want to bore you guys any more about myself. A leader is a dealer in hope. That quote, Napoleon, that quote from Napoleon lays out a foundation for a leader and what I plan to be, a dealer in hope. I call my plan for presidency the Hilltop Reconstruction Act of 2014, which focuses on two major points, unity and diplomacy. Under unity, my goal is to bring everyone together and help everyone who needs it. One of the major things I plan to establish for next year is a peer counseling group where students who don't feel comfortable with adults can talk to other students who have been through tough times as well. I want to use this to also get students away from depression, being outcasted, and into more welcoming environments, so to say. This will help branch students into clubs like dance, fencing, culinary, or even a school sport. Clubs helped me and saved me, and I hope we'll be able to assist others as it did me. Along with that, we have diplomacy, where I further will benefit students, and I have tons of ideas already, but that's not the point. To be a strong leader, you must be a strong listener, and I accept ideas from other individuals. I'll make myself available a half hour to an hour every day in some makeshift office I established somewhere in Durfee, so I can take criticism and ideas, and I'll put up a suggestions box for everyone to drop off ideas also. A Google Docs will be created for everyone in the class to access to type up events that they want publicized. Now, I'm also thinking ahead to the future, when we're all old and wrinkly, for our high school reunions. Before we become crazed oldies, though, we have senior prom, the biggest event in high schoolers' life, as everyone else puts it. I know it has to be good, the best, the most enjoyable night ever. Before you assume anything, no, it won't be a Star Wars-themed prom. I wouldn't put my interests above others. All of us must agree on something before it's put into place. We have to start to plan for our futures now, and I will put that into motion, everything, to help our school in the years that precede us. 
Under the presidency of Louis Cabral, I will make the class of 2015 the class of fortune, justice, and progress. To end us off, here's one last Napoleon quote. There is no such thing as accident. It is fate misnamed. Voting Louis Cabral is no accident. Remember that. And God bless America, God bless Massachusetts, and God bless Durfee's class of 2015. Goodbye, everyone. A wise man once said, we can't change the world unless we change ourselves. That man was Biggie Smalls. More important than the question of who am I is the question of who are we? We can be the Durfee you read about in the paper, the school constantly highlighted for its negativity, or we can be something more. We can be something new. We can be something better. Every day, I encounter diverse students who all deal with different goals and problems, individuals. But I also encounter individuals who compromise something much greater. We are who we are. Whether you play third baseman or you play the bass for orchestra, you're a hilltopper. Whether you attend every class meeting or join every club, or you dedicate yourself to the one activity that gives you comfort, you're a hilltopper. There are many things that make us different, but there is one thing that makes us all the same. The fact that we all attend the same school, that we are all one heartbeat and one team, that we are Durfee High School. Now if this is true, then we can't succeed on the world stage unless we make a difference first in our school and in our community. As I witness many incredibly talented persons each day, I only wish that the school as a whole had more of a reputation and more of the respect it deserves, the respect we deserve. We can't change the world unless we first change ourselves. And as I set out for our final year of high school, as we set out for our final year of high school, there is no doubt that change is inevitable on all of our minds. So let's change ourselves. This June 11th, you can vote for your friends, or you can vote for an idea. You can vote for change. Vote for change this election year. Vote Mason Tebalt, Senior Class Secretary. Hello, Class of 2015. My name is Ayanna Porter, and I want to be your Vice President. While you may be thinking you haven't seen much of me in student government these past few years, I can assure you I've been plugging in all along. I am a club leader of two clubs. I'm the National Honor Society, and I'm headed into my fourth year on the volleyball team. I decided to run because I'm aware of the problems that face our class, but more importantly, I can acknowledge our potential. And with just a few changes here and there, I'm confident we can create a more conducive learning environment for ourselves. As Vice President, I would use your ideas as well as my own to collaborate with the rest of student government to ensure your voice, our voice, is heard. Because I've learned one's voice is his power. So please, elect AP for VP. Hello, I'm Brendan Rocket, and I'm running for student body treasurer. I'm a highly motivated student and will be good in this position. I know some of you through clubs and sports I've been in this year, and I hope to get your vote this election, June 11th. Thank you. Hi, Durfee. For those of you who do not yet know me, my name is Meredith Forcier, and I am running for, to be your student body treasurer. While I was not involved in student government this past year, I have taken part in numerous activities to strengthen my personal and leadership skills. In our school, I am involved in many clubs such as the National Honor Society, Math Team, Freedom Writers, and Green Team, and the Interact Club, where I was served as president this year. And as an athlete for our school, I play varsity field hockey, where I will serve as captain next year. This experience has shown me the privilege and pride to wear the name Durfee across my chest, and I hope to carry this pride into a leadership position for our school and begin to grow and strengthen what is already immensely present. In our city, I have taken part in community projects and am currently serving as youth facilitator of the Fall River Youth Leadership Council. In our Commonwealth, I serve as chairperson of Governor Patrick's Project 351 Alumni Leadership Council, where youth from across our state come together to unite, act, and lead. As having the great privilege to serve as a class officer in student government in my freshman year, I know of the great responsibility and commitment it takes to stay dedicated to this position. I am more than ready to serve as your student body treasurer and will give my all every day in representing our school with pride and handling any finances. And it doesn't hurt that I happen to love math. I have always had a strong passion for community and helping our school to become its greatest self. It is my promise that I'll put forth my best to help us reach our best together. Thank you and make sure to vote Meredith for student body treasurer in the upcoming elections. Hello. My name is Brianna Raposo and I am running for the position of student body secretary. Having held the position of class treasurer before, I feel like this is a great step on my path of leadership. During the past three years, I have worked hard to embody Durfee's mission statement and project it forward. 
My purpose here is to set an example for those around me. I feel as if it is my responsibility to give our student body a voice and to let everyone be heard. I plan to innovate our current systems and improve unity. I plan to work diligently on all tasks at hand and to focus hard to follow them through. And lastly, I plan on aiding in the empowerment of all of my fellow classmates. I, Brianna Raposo, would greatly appreciate your vote and I thank you in advance for any you may cast. See you on election day. Hello Durfee, my name is Kelsey Rogers and I'm running for the position of student body secretary. Throughout my life, I've had a lot of experience being a leader. In elementary school and middle school, I participated in student government. In my freshman, my freshman year, I held the position of class president. I'm a member of the Freedom Writers Club and a captain of the sixth man. I bleed red and black. This past year, I also served as secretary of the National Honor Society. As secretary, I developed strong observational and organizational skills, skills which are essential to holding office and aid in assisting the concerns and assessing of the concerns of the student body and making a positive change. I strongly support all the programs this school offers and entirely believe that all clubs and sports deserve equal opportunities. I'm, the most, I'm not the most athletic or artistic, but I can promise you I'm the most determined. John F. Kennedy, John F. Kennedy once said, effort and courage are not enough without purpose and direction. As Hilltoppers, our direction is up, and together we can climb the hill to success. If you elect me as your student body secretary, I will pledge to you my time and my dedication. I can't promise you weekly field trips or an endless summer, but I have many great ideas that will undoubtedly ensure an excellent school year. Vote for me, Kelsey Rodrigues, for student body secretary, and together we will show the world what Durfee Hilltoppers are capable of. Hi, my name is Keegan Murphy, and I'm running for your student body vice president. And let me start off by saying how honored I would be if you elected me as student body vice president. As someone who is involved in student government, I would be a great asset for our school. This year as junior class treasurer, I contributed greatly to the activities that made this year enjoyable, including pep rally, junior prom, and the upcoming safety day. As we end this year, I hope we can strive even higher and make the 2014-2015 school year the best one yet. As your student body VP, I would like to create more school activities, more beneficial fundraisers, and improve the overall school spirit. I will work to actively participate in the decision make making that will positively impact our school and our community. As a student body vice president, I will make sure to listen to all of my peers. I know the dedication and responsibility that is required, and I'm ready for the challenge. If you elect me for your student body vice president, you will not regret it. I will make this year the most memorable year of all. I am proud to be a Jeffy Hilltopper, and I'd be even more honored if you titled me as student body vice president. Remember, on election day, please vote me, Keegan Murphy, for your student body vice president. Spread the word, Murphy for Durfee. Hi, my name is Lucas Fernandez, and for the past three years, I have been a proud member of Durfee Student Government. Throughout these three years, I have learned how to be a leader and how to represent my school. I have bled red and black since the day I walked in as a freshman by embracing many opportunities I was given, such as being a member of Sixth Man, the Freedom Riders, and Student Government, along with sports like soccer and volleyball. I am challenging myself to take this role as student body president because I believe I have potential to lead my school. I like to think that if you dedicate time and effort to something, anything is possible. So don't ever let anyone tell you you can't do anything. And to achieve this, I need your help. So vote Lucas Fernandez for your student body president.